Konnichiwa, mean and this and you're watching Bucket Cast. Today's timid first person's video is going to be on a PS4 game, and that is Persona 4 Dancing All Night. So excited to have this game digitally on the PS4. Absolutely adored it on the Vita. Actually, Platinum Knit, the Japanese version and the English version, so it's great to have this on here. And it's going to be fun to really get down and enjoy it. As always, 10 minutes to play the game. First, I'm playing the game of version of, and I can't skip anything. Let's get the timer started. Timer's been started, and let's, let's do this. Well, good to that. Uh, Persona 4, uh, Dancing All Night. There are two primary modes, story mode and free mode, where you can enjoy dance gameplay. Select your preferred option in menu. In free dance, you can enjoy the rhythm gameplay with the difficulty and track of your choice. As you play, you will gain new tracks and money for shopping. It is recommended that first time players play the tutorial in the pause menu. Yes, it's always good to do this because if I remember correctly, it's a trophy. Hello, everybody. Professor Teddy here. Well, Sensei and the others are learning their steps, we should ought to try out some dancing too. Let's start with the basics. Press the buttons to match your timing with, with the flying notes. You get the idea? All right. Now it's your turn now. Feel the rhythm and push those buttons. Yeah, that's how you do it. Okay, time for lesson two. Sometimes you'll see things like this. Those are scratches. For those, you just flick the left or right analog stick. Even if you mention that's a count as a mistake. So don't stress out over them. When the ring overlaps with the outer cellar, just move the stick in any direction. It's like the last one looked kind of funky, right? This is called a fever ring. They're pretty much like scratches. But if you get enough of them right, your dance is going to go into fever mode or fever type. All kind of good things happen. You get it whenever you can. Now, last up is the gauge with win. This hype gauge tells you how much the audience is enjoying the show. Depending on how good your dancing is, it'll change like this. If the extent is too low, then that's it. The show's over. And even if you dance to the end, you only win. I mean, Tara, she's hyped up. Saying good, good. All right. Now let's bring it home. Nice. Till next time, everybody. Uh, yes, tutorial number two. Fortunately, there are some. Yo, yo, yo. Time to give me to get into your next lesson and rolling. First, I'm going to talk about the these things called unison notes. Sometimes these stretchy notes come out you. These are unison notes. You got to press two buttons at the same time. Give it a shot. There's Press the two buttons connected with the notes. There we are. These, of course, are horrible. They can drive you crazy. How'd you do? Okay, next up, we're going to talk about the hold notes.
Okay. That's what makes it nice. Hold notes are fun. It makes it really fun when they try doing multiples at the same time. Because it goes crazy. Okay, now it's all high hyped up and clear the stage. Nice. And here goes some more hold notes. Nice. Nice moves. That's it. The bear is nothing left to teach you. Had tons of fun dancing with you. Bye bye, everyone. All right. Let's go in and enjoy this one. Don't have anything chosen. So, you know, just go into it. one yeah I missed one huh weird hmm a track has been added we're seeing my true self okay Ooh, good song. Don't have enough time for it, but we're going to do what we can.
love the music in this game. Okay. Well, I am very, very happy to have this, and I really will enjoy going through this game one more time and just having fun, because it really is a great rhythm-based game. Got some fantastic mu uh, uh, music in here. The story is uh, really entertaining, and I really enjoyed it. So I'm just so happy to have this on the PS4 now. And uh, I got a trophy! Somehow. Okay. Yes. That was weird. Anyway, so... Yeah, I'm actually really excited to have this part of the collection. Um, and it will definitely be a game I will work on and get platinum because I love this one. I'm really excited to have this, have the, this, and with it being part of the the whole collection, now I have three games to work on, but this will be the first one I'll just get out of the way because I kind of have to. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed watching. This is Tisa Kura saying ciao and sayonara.